Now in this question is asking the crystal field stabilization energy CFSE of FeH2 whole 6 Cl2 and K2 NiCl4 respectively are. Now first we have to find out the system of the cation or the central metal ion. So if we talk about the Fe2 plus it is D6 system and it is Ni2 plus it is D8 system. So let us move on to the solution. Now we have two different cations first is Fe2 plus and another is nickel 2 plus. Now if you talk about the electronic configuration, the electronic configuration in the case of Fe2 plus according to crystal field theory it will be T2G 4 Eg 2 right and in nickel 2 plus now that is octahedral this is tetrahedral it will be E4 T2 4 right. Now we can find out the value of CFSE and the value of CFSE in the first case will be minus 0 0.4 delta O and it will be minus 0 0.8 delta T right. So, our answer will be option number 3. So, this is the correct answer. Let us move on to the next question. Now, in this question, for the reaction twice SO2 plus O2 in equilibrium with twice SO3, delta H, the enthalpy change is given minus 57.2 kilojoule per mole and Kc is equal to 1.7 10 to the minus 16, which of the following statement is incorrect. So, we have to find out the incorrect statement. The first one is the equilibrium constant is large suggestive of the reaction going to completion and so no catalyst is required. Now, this is absolutely wrong. We use V2O5 as a catalyst for the formation of SO3, right. So, let us check other options also. The addition of the inert gas at the constant volume will not affect the equilibrium. That is correct. The equilibrium will shift in the forward direction as the pressure is increased. Absolutely correct. The equilibrium constant decreases as the temperature increases. That is also correct. So, the incorrect option is number 1 that is our answer. So, answer is the first one, right. Let us move on to the next question. Now, in this question is asking hydrated solid X on heating initially gives monohydrated compound Y, Y upon heating above the temperature 373 Kelvin leads to an anhydrous white powder Z, X and Z respectively are. Now, the solution should be so if you see the all four options it should be na2co3 dot 10 h2o and it gives na to co3 dot H2O plus 9 H2O right and further this Na2 CO3 dot H2O he is heating it above 373 Kelvin. So, it will again dehydrate. So, it is temperature more than 373 Kelvin, it will become 
एन ए टू सी ओ थ्री प्लस एच टू ओ नाउ दिस इज द एनहाइड्रस फॉर्म सो वी कैन से दैट दिस इज एक्स एंड दिस इज जेड एंड एन ए टू सी ओ थ्री द अदर नेम ऑफ एन ए टू सी ओ थ्री इज सोडा एश एंड दिस इज वॉशिंग सोडा वी ऑल नो सो द आंसर शुड बी ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री सो द आंसर इज ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री लेट्स मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन